I'm sitting, standing at 22433 uh, Old Highway 99 in Gazelle. This is an extremely unusual outdoor barbecue area for this gorgeous triple wide manufactured home. In the distance there is the big ditch. The original ditch they dug to feed the gold mines in Wairika. We're going to go walking around here. It's all wildlife, obviously. On the hills around us. Look at this deck. The owners are still not finished. You can see there's uh, some material lying about. Oh, metal roof, which is to say a very long life roof. There's an example of the wildlife right there, a little blue belly lizard. I'm instructed to close this door because the lizard decides to come in and visit from time to time. Look at the size of these rooms. This, of course, the exercycle and the sofa will all be gone. Here's a window air conditioning unit, which remains. You can see by the register in the floor that there's central heating and air. Or excuse me, central heating. Got a heat pump, bookcase will be gone. Firewood stove, they say, heats the entire property and I can understand that. Look at the size of this room. Let's go down and check the bedrooms first. Probably a total of 2,500 feet, three bedroom, two bath, but they've added quite a bit. Is one bedroom. Lots of light. Beautiful pastel colors and window, lots of windows, vinyl clad, of course. Little guest bath. Bedroom number two. And let's see, thermostat, of course. This is the master we're coming into. Oh, behind this door here is the heat pump. It's not a closet. And you can see how in a manufactured home they allow heat to travel between rooms with those devices. The owners are going to leave this portable air conditioner that you see on our left here. That uh, is a very, I don't know how many BTUs, but it's huge. Master, look at these views. I'll show you more in the kitchen, but we're overlooking the Shasta Valley and the Interstate 5 way out there. Going into the master bath, beautiful cabinetry. Jetted tub, nice shower enclosure, and one of the few toilets with a, a view of the valley. <laughs> okay, let's take a look at the kitchen next. I think you'll be impressed. I don't know anyone who wouldn't be. The main thing I noticed about this property is the huge size of the rooms. It's just amazing. Look at this. That again is you're looking at Shasta Valley. can't make it out from here, but the I-5 in the distance, the weed rest stop, weed area rest stop, and the weed airport. And the owner of this property is the fixed base operator of that airport. 
all appliances included, except the treadmill. But you have washer and dryer. Interesting feature. Firewood comes directly in from outdoors and into your fireplace. Water heaters behind this door. Main electrical panel. And this is unique. This is almost like a mother-in-law quarters. Um, this door is lockable. You can see it's uh, covered over. This area here leads to a separate entrance. To the front. And the garage. As you can see, they've got a some cleaning to do, but this is one way to come in the home if you don't use the front door. And the best for last. Look at this area. With its own heater. Look at the size of this room. And now look at the view. That is something. Okay, 22433 North, excuse me, Old Highway 99 in Gazelle. I'm standing here at 201 Ida Street in Mount Shasta. I think these are camellias, but I'm not sure, but they're gorgeous. There's a beautiful old residential neighborhood of, Lake, of uh, Mount Shasta. Homes here go back to the 40s and maybe even before. But um, sweet three bedroom, two bath with look at these floors. The original narrow plank hardwood. You never see these anymore. Bright living room. Monitor heat as well as a fireplace, and it looks like a heat later on the fireplace. Formal dining room. The furnishings that you see will not be here, of course, particularly the piano. And we'll go down the hallway a little ways here. can't get over these floors. Look at that. Anyway, there's two bedrooms here. I'll show you the bathroom in just a minute. This leads downstairs to the parking and other bedroom and bathroom. It's an ideal setup. Look at this bathroom. Brand new cabinets. I think this is travertine, I'm not sure. Tile work. Shower. Whole, wholly redone bathroom. Just gorgeous. Here's one bedroom. Baseboard heating. Another bedroom here. This one's going to be painted, so the little spots on the wall are going to disappear. What I like about the home, besides everything else, is, is how light it is. Okay, now look at this kitchen. Drop dead kitchen. Look at this. All new refrigerator, under counter, under cabinet, I should say, lighting. Light, airy, nice little island here. And then look at this, right off the kitchen, little sunroom. 
perfect for growing uh, plants and uh, maybe a sowing area leading directly out onto this very private backyard. This is a gorgeous home. 201 Ida Street in Mount Shasta, California.